If you've driven through Springfield lately, you may have seen some activity in the Connecticut River. 22 News Storm Team Meteorologist Jennifer Pye found out what crews are working on. You may have noticed cranes and barges in the Connecticut River in the past few weeks. It's the Pilot Cat Project, and Columbia Gas is working to clean tar from the Connecticut River that was left there decades ago. Columbia Gas of Massachusetts takes the environment very seriously, and any compromises that we might have been responsible for, we are committed to remediate and take care of. The Springfield Gas Light Company, a predecessor company to Columbia Gas, operated a plant that manufactured gas from coal from the mid 1800s to early 1900s. During this operation, liquid tar was discharged and is still there now. It was found along a two mile stretch from Riverfront Park to the South End Bridge. The project is uh, constructing 10 individual caps that are made up of uh, different types of material, stone, uh, different sizes and different configurations. And five of them will be placed right behind me at the uh, Springfield Yacht Club where you can see that. And the other five will be down closer to Memorial Park. These caps will separate the tar from water. Columbia Gas will monitor these caps over the next two years. There is no significant risk to human health from the tar under current conditions. There is also no risk to the environment. All equipment should be removed from the river by Christmas. In Springfield, meteorologist Jennifer Paye, 22 News.